You may heard of Power Query, you may heard of GAN Transform, but you are just unable to locate that particular functionality in your Excel version. In this video, you are going to see how we are able to get the functionality of Power Query into Excel, even though you are using a little bit older version of Excel. Now I'm going to a website, Google, and start searching for Power Query add-in. And usually on the first few one, you are able to see there's something called Download Microsoft Power Query or Excel from Microsoft official website. Click on this and you're able to see the language you want to choose and you're able to download it. Prior to that, you may want to check on the system requirements, make sure you fulfill all the requirements, particularly on your operating systems as well as the office you are currently using. So once you check everything is okay, then you can click on the download. Then you ask you whether you are using 32-bit or 64-bit. So you just want to choose the appropriate version and click and go next and you are able to download and install. After install, you just need to enable it in your COM add-in. After you have downloaded the Power Query add-in and installed it in your computer, the next thing is you want to switch it on so that you are able to use it. Because I'm using newer version of Excel, so I will not able to install and switch it on. But the way of searching the COM add-in and to switch it on is the same steps. So I will go to the file. Then I will go to the bottom left section. Here's something called Options. And go to Add-ins. Inside add-ins, you just go to manage. Instead of Excel add-ins, you want to choose COM add-ins and click on the go button. And you will see COM add-in, one of them is Power Query. Have a checkbox on that and press OK. And on the ribbon here on the top, you will see Power Query appears. So you are able to follow and use the Power Query as per others video you may able to find online. I hope these simple steps is able to help you to experience the power of Power Query in whatever Excel version you are using at this present moment. And if you find this video is useful and benefiting to you, please consider to subscribe to this channel and share this video to your friends and colleagues so that they are able to learn something new in Excel.